Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm here with my rumor baby Shiloh. And so today we're gonna be changing her for the 12th day of the reborn countdown to Christmas. And I didn't realize, but yesterday would make it two weeks until Christmas. So there's 13 days left today. And um, I thought we'd change Shiloh. She looks so cute in this outfit. This is, I'm pretty sure this is Jimbery also. And um, it's a really cute like cable knit sweater style uh, romper and I really like this on her and it also works for girls or boys so I like that I can use this for both of my um, well for all of my three month babies so it's really adorable I just really like it on her and then I just put this little pink bow with it so you could tell she was a little girl and yeah so that's what she's been wearing and I really like it and then we're gonna change her into this outfit from Carter's it has these like jegging style pants so they look like jeans but they're really like leggings and then it's like a tunic top and a little vest. It's a little white vest that has a pink bow and then a pretty flower tunic. It has all different kinds of flowers. We're gonna keep her headband or her um, hair bow on. And I brought a little brush to do her hair. And I was gonna bring little shoes, but I did not. I can always put them on her though. All right, hopefully we don't have that much trouble with the little buttons over here because with Teddy's outfit, we had so much trouble, and then with Harlow's, we had a little bit of trouble. Hers doesn't seem to have that much problems, though. That just didn't make sense. But yeah, I'm pretty sure this is Jimbery. I really like this outfit. It looks super cute. Yeah, it's Jimbery. I just, like, sometimes I can't remember where I get them, but I try to remember. And for everyone wondering, Shiloh is the um, Saskia kit by Bonnie Brown, and she was painted by... Stephanie um, Ortiz of M Level 3 Awards 2011, and she was rooted by Jackie, um, Stephanie's wife, so heart to heart babies. Super pretty, so I love this baby. She I got around um, this time last year, actually, so we've had Shiloh for a year. This is, it's so crazy, because I got her a little bit after, it's actually I've had her for longer than a year, I guess, because I got her a little bit after Thanksgiving last year. I remember I was gonna, I was hoping to bring her to Thanksgiving to my aunt's with me, but she didn't arrive in time and I was so sad because I wanted her to come visit. But I'm pretty sure I brought her with me to um, Christmas. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. She's really cute. All right. I think soon we're gonna start putting the babies into their Christmas outfits since it's getting closer. Her hair I'm gonna have to fix because it got a little messed up. She looks so cute. She has a little chevron diaper on. I swear she had a different diaper on. I must have changed it and forgot about it. That's funny. All right. So we have her little pants. They're a little bit um, loose around the ankle. And I kind of wish they were tighter so it would look cuter. I don't know. I kind of like when they have the tight pants. But these ones, oops. These ones are a little loose, but that's okay. Here we go. Her little feet look so cute in these. <laughs> She's such a big girl, I love Shiloh. Here we go. And then I have to take this vest off. It comes off, so you don't have to wear the little vest. You can put it with other outfits. But I like it with this outfit, it's really cute. I was having a hard time deciding what I wanted to put on Shiloh today because she looks so cute in like every single outfit. All my babies really look cute in every outfit. I just wanted to find something and I remembered I have this one and no one's worn it in a little while so I thought I'd put it on Shiloh and that's what we're doing. She just whacked herself in the face. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> so cute. These colors look nice on her. I was gonna put a little, I have a magnetic yellow bow for her. And actually, it's the one that came with her, and I was going to put it on her, and I remembered last time I had Cecilia wear it, it came undone, like the bow came untied, and so, I know her hair's a mess, I need to fix that after I get her little vest on. But yeah, her, the little yellow bow came untied, and I was so surprised, because I didn't know they could come untied, so I was really sad about that. <laughs> Alright, I think that was just easier to put her little vest on while she's already flipped around. Alright, here we go. And then, I always have trouble with these little vests because the button never want to go on the little elastic. Did I get it? No. Oh, there it is. Okay. Perfect. She's 
just kind of falling. All right, now we can brush her hair with the little toothbrush that I use. Try and keep her hair nice and neat. She has such pretty hair and it's so soft. I don't know who I think out of my babies has the softest hair, but I think she's definitely up there. A lot of them have really soft hair actually, I like that. Super cute. Her hair is always so messy because she's like laying down on this little bouncer all the time. So it just gets so messy in the back. That's okay. She looks cute from the front. <laughs> there we go. And she has her little magnet. Magnetic pacifier. Or not pacifier. <laughs> it could be a little pacifier because that would look kind of funny. Her little bow. I like those a lot. Because that doesn't really mess with the hair trying to get the bow, like the headband all over their hair. So I like the magnetic little bows. Super cute. Here's little Shiloh and she looks so cute. There we go, guys. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Please click like and subscribe and in the comments. Let us know if any of your babies have a magnetic hair bow. And we'll see you guys later. Bye!